good morning students so today in this video i am going to explain you the summary of this story a rupees goes a long way so this story is written by ruskin bond and it is a story is a very remarkable story of ruskin bond okay so ruskin bond born on 19th may 1934 ruskin bond is an indian author of british descent he spent his early childhood in simla and gujarat most of his stories are about life in the hill station he was awarded the padma shri in 1999 and padma bhushan in 2014 they are having some more remarkable book by ruskin bond that is cherry tree the india i love spocky ghost mr oliver's diary and many more so just move with this story a rupees goes a long way they are having three characters the first is ranji the second is koki and the third is mohinder so now move through a short summary of the story so that you will understand what exactly the story is all about so this story is about ranji who sets out to the bazaar with a 1 rupee coin hoping to buy jalebis but the shopkeeper does not accept his coin calling it no good means there is no value of this coin and the shopkeeper said it is not old enough to be valuable and it is not new enough to buy anything ranji managed to exchange his no good coin for a fishing rod but because of the dry season and the shallow stream he is not able to fish his mind is still on the jalebis ranji moves ahead this time he exchanges the rod for a flute he soon realizes he is not a very good flute player but to his luck he is able to exchange exchange the flute for a necklace of brightly colored stone the stones are found in the mountains near tibet so this time he is lucky because he finally gets a rupee in exchange of the pretty necklace his ingenuity helps him to reach his goal he buys the hot jalebis and enjoys the fruits of his labor with his friend koki so this is the whole story is all about so what you have to do you just read the story that is mentioned in your book and just try to listen this video so that you will clearly understand what the story is all about okay so thank you for today